I love myself. Um, and mostly in, in the last year I managed to, to love myself even more. Uh, I think thanks to Diana, uh, as my previous relationships were um, like the, the guys I was staying with uh, that were very, very different from each other, uh, like straight uh, older man or younger boy. Uh, I, I was in the last relationship I was with, it was with a, with a, uh, a gay boy. Uh, of my same age, yeah, he's gay, uh, but we were in a relationship and it was very judgmental, but I loved him, he didn't uh, appreciate some things of my body and he was always checking on how, how much or what I was eating, and uh, so I, I was more self-conscious about my body and I saw that in order to please him I was becoming like looking more like a, a tranny, if you want, or more like um, uh, like becoming man in a, in my body shape. But now I I do appreciate much more my my body than before. <laughs> I I felt extremely liberated the first time that I had sex with Diana. It's been a, a long journey to get there, uh, but I think the last couple of years I've. Um, uh, tried to understand what that is and actually put it into practice. So I'm actively loving myself, not just having this vague notion of, yes, I do love myself. I'm happy. I'm, I, I don't know how to translate that in words. I think this is the first time in my life where I have no anxiety surrounding um, the being together with another person, the sharing of uh, thoughts, ideas, uh, physicality with another person and to me not having that anxiety and having complete trust is what I define as happiness.